to November now in the race for U.S. Senate, the first major Republican in the race tonight. 12 News political director Matt Smith in Madison, where late this afternoon, Eric Hovde launched his bid for Senate. Republican Eric Hovde a short time ago making it official here in Madison tonight. He is running for U.S. Senate, his second attempt at Senate. Are you ready to go fight for your country? The Republican businessman making the announcement inside a building developed by his real estate company. Hovde first ran back in 2012, but lost in the Republican primary to former Governor Tommy Thompson. The campaign tonight looking to highlight his Wisconsin roots. Hovde is CEO of a Madison-based real estate company, also several banking companies. Democrats already criticizing his property that he owns in California. Hovde in part tonight saying he's running to help unite the country. I will reach across the aisle. I don't believe what's going on in Washington works. In the world of business, if you want to get things done, you have to compromise. Now, does that mean I will compromise my principles? No. Several other Republicans could still get in this race tonight, including Scott Mayer, a businessman from Wisconsin. Former Milwaukee County Sheriff David Clark has also expressed some interest. No mention tonight from Hovde of former President Donald Trump, the Republican frontrunner in the race for president. In Madison, I'm Matt Smith, WISN 12 News. The incumbent Democratic Senator Tammy Baldwin responded on X saying if Hovde defeats her, he'd help Mitch McConnell and national Republicans ban abortion, gut Social Security and repeal the Affordable Care Act. Here's more from the senator earlier today in Janesville. This race is about uh, making sure that working people, working families have a voice in Washington, D.C., uh, not just the powers of the primary for U.S. Senate is set for August 13th with the general election scheduled for November 5th.